Welcome back to J Muddy 93. I am Jeremy Werner. So in Buffalo, New York today, actually I should say over the last few days, we received quite a bit of snow. And just looking throughout the yard here, it's actually pretty deep and compact. I'm a little bit cold, so uh, I'm doing this video intro now because I'm gonna warm up a bit, but uh, I gotta move a few vehicles and plow but we're gonna have a little bit of fun too while we're at it. So anyhow, please like and subscribe. One thing I do wanna to mention too, before I start this video, I have my leak dry hat on and I can tell you this, this hat is definitely one of the warmest hats that I ever worn. It has a neoprene insulin on the inside of it and wool on the outside. So it keeps it, all the wind from actually blowing through my hat and it keeps me nice and warm. So, anyhow, let's get to plowing and let's have some fun. People comment to me, but well, I had people tell me, Oh, you're going too fast, you're going too fast. Honestly, I'm not really going too fast, I'm only doing about four or five miles per hour. It's not really fast at all. In fact, it's just right so I can actually push all this snow. And you know, I get asked, well, how come you don't do like winter wheeling videos? I'm going to be honest. I'm out in this stuff enough, shoveling. Do you think I really want to be out in the snow getting cold? wet, then I have to worry about cleaning this thing? No, not really. But at the same time, you know, when I, I also mentioned on Instagram too that there's a couple of changes coming to the channel. Well, yeah, there will be, because I want to mention too that I teamed up with Buzz Energy Off-Road, which they are a group in uh, Canada, so this year, besides Busco, I'm going to try to make it up to Canada more often, but also too, if anyone thinks the Outlander is for sale, they're gladly mistaken. I've had so many questions whether this thing is for sale or not, and I'm gonna be honest with you, no. I, I had, I've had so much, I have so much sentimental value in here that no one is going to be able to pay what I've done in maintenance and suspension work and clutch work and Honestly, it all adds up. And if someone really wants her, they'll pay me the value of the, what I feel it's worth. But it's why I'm keeping it on the channel still because the new machine potentially doesn't have fenders to give you an idea. But I'm not really going to give too many details. There's some people that know about what I'm doing. There's some people that don't know what I'm doing. And honestly, 
I think that clue pretty much gives it away. It's just you gotta figure out what exactly I'm doing because there's a lot of things that don't have fenders. Like a Yamaha Raptor, uh, there's a Banshee, uh, Blair Scrambler, Can-Am Renegade. You never know, I could even be buying a dirt bike for all we know. But, uh, anyhow, I'm still keeping the Outlander on the channel. She's been a good girl to me, except for a few situations, which it is what it is. But, for anyone out there that knows me, this also leaves a potential opportunity for you to ride on my wheeler. Like this wheeler in particular, because she's been sorted and gone through. Okay, now that we're done plowing the driveway, next thing we're gonna do, gonna have a little fun, and uh, then we'll head inside. It is chilly. 11 degrees and whew, it's definitely cold. That was fun. I'd send it over the snow pile a bit. Let's try it. Alright. Got our path cleared. Let's send it.
All right. As you can see here, the snow is so deep here. Even though I don't have my plow dropped, basically the front of my wheeler is acting as a plow. This is freaking wild. <laughs> Whoa, that, that is deep. Turn around back here. This branch is kind of in the way. Ah! Sorry, tree huggers. I'm not trying to take out the tree. Ah! But, whew. Anyhow, folks, I got to go clean, warm up, clean this wheeler up of all the snow. But, whoo, I had fun. So, anyhow, if you can, please like and subscribe, and I would greatly appreciate it.